Christmas? Thank you. I thought you were avoiding me. What gave you that idea? In the last six weeks, you've only been in my elevator once, mm -hmm. and you didn't take off your hat. Well, as a matter of fact, I was rather hurt that night you stood me up. I don't blame you. It was unforgivable. I forgive you. Well, you shouldn't. You couldn't help yourself. I mean, when you're having a drink with one man, you can't suddenly walk out on him because you're having another date with another man. You did the only decent thing. I wouldn't be too sure. Just because I wear a uniform, that doesn't make me a Girl Scout. Miss Kublik, one doesn't get to be a second administrative assistant around here unless he's a pretty good judge of character. And as far as I'm concerned, you're tops. I mean, decency-wise and otherwise-wise. <laughs> Cheers. One more. Oh, I shouldn't drink while I'm driving. You're so right. By the power vested in me, I herewith declare this elevator out of order. Shall we join the natives? Why not? They seem friendly enough. Don't you believe it. After a while, there'll be human sacrifices. White collar workers tossed into the computing machines and punched through those little square holes. <laughs> How many drinks did you have? Three. <laughs> Wait a minute. I think I hear the sound of running water. I'll be right back. I'll be right here. Hi. I'm the branch manager from Kansas City. I beg your pardon? I'm Miss Olson, Mr. Sheldrake's secretary. So you don't have to play innocent with me. He used to tell his wife I was the branch manager from Seattle four years ago. We were having a little ring a ding dance. Oh, I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about. Just before me, there was Miss Rossi in auditing, and after me, there was Miss Crunch in disability, and right before you was a Miss, um, oh, what's her name? Uh, on the 25th floor. Would you excuse me? What floor? You haven't done anything. Tim. Oh, what a salesman. Always the last booth in the Chinese restaurant, and the same pitch about divorcing his wife. <laughs> and in the end, you wind up with egg foo young on your face. Excuse me. Well, thank you, Miss Olson. Always happy to do a little something for our girls in uniform. Are you all right, Miss Manning? Um, I think there are just too many people here. I hope you step into my office. There's something I want your opinion about, anyhow. <laughs> I have my own office now, naturally. You may be interested to know that I am the second youngest executive in this company. The only one younger is the grandson of the chairman of the board. <laughs> Would you mind? I would like your honest opinion. I've had this under my desk for a week. It cost me $15. I haven't been able to get up enough nerve to work. <laughs> It's what they call the junior executive model. What do you think? I guess I made a bobo, huh? I like it. Really? You wouldn't be ashamed to be seen with somebody in a hat like this? Of course not. Maybe if I wore it a little more to one side. How's that? Is that better? Much better. Wow. Well. Since you wouldn't be ashamed to be seen with me, how about the three of us going out tonight? You, me, and the bowler. <laughs> we'll stroll down Fifth Avenue, sort of break it in. This is a bad day for me. Oh, I understand. Christmas family and all that. Yeah. I'd better get back to my elevator. I don't want to be fine. Hey, you don't have to worry about that. I've got quite a bit of influence in personnel. You know Mr. Sheldrake? Why? Well, he and I are like that. He sent me a Christmas card. Makes a cute picture. I thought maybe I'd put in a word for you. Would Mr. Sheldrake get you a little promotion? How would you like to be an elevator starter? I'm afraid there are too many girls around here with seniority over me. No problem. Why don't we discuss it sometime over the holidays? I can call you and pick you up. We have a big unveiling. Are you sure this is the right way to wear this? I think so. Here. You don't think it's tilted a little too much? I mean, after all, this is a conservative firm. I don't want people to think I'm an entertainer. I like it that way. Makes me look the way I feel. Your phone. Yes? Uh, just a minute. 